I've got two speeches tomorrow for the mine workers and the machinists. I face the question that we've got a lot of stuff in which we found Miller off base. Also Goldwater, 60,000 misfits in the Army. Miller on this immigration and so on and so forth. Now, my own personal reaction is right now that, that we've got nothing to gain by my arguing with Miller. I wouldn't, and I've asked my cabinet people, please don't do it. They do it. Freeman and you'd all do it, but I sure wouldn't. I'd be above them if I were you, and I'd talk about what we stand for and what we're doing and what uh, uh, the workers are doing and how the industry's working with us, and I'd try to put them all under one tent and uh, be the leader of everybody instead of uh, yip yakking them, because you get out there and you just add Advertise them, and they have trouble making an argument if we don't argue with them. They can't argue with themselves. My own instinct completely. And you, I think on your your backlash thing, uh, the the figures New Haven last night shows us 34 percent front lash and 7 percent backlash. It shows Kennedy carried New Haven by 65, and we're carrying it by 77. Uh, that's Andy Goldwater stuff, and uh, that's Oliver Quayle called a man. They just finished a survey for the mayor up in New Haven, Connecticut. And we're finishing one in Pennsylvania this week, and we think that if we'll just uh, talk about uh, the danger of a woman having a two-headed baby and men yeah. becoming sterile and drinking contaminated milk and these things, that they'll know who they ought to be scared of without our ever saying so, and that's the thing we ought to keep up. Okay. John Pomfret, the uh, New York Times is just back from Gary, where he's done a special study, which I asked him to do, frankly, on the uh, backlash. He said he can't find any of it even there. Now. Well, Gallup's coming out this week with a 7% over the nation, and that's mostly Mississippi and Alabama only. Yeah. Spread it out. But the front lash, I am getting 2% more Republican votes in New Haven, Connecticut, than Goldwater. 34 to 32. Sure, sure. <laughs> that's unthinkable, isn't it? Republicans, I'm talking about. I'm not talking about that. It was not presumptuous. I think even the front bash thing, we could uh, we could start forgetting about. I think that's right. That's a phrase. That's right. But uh, if they insist on bringing it in, well, I'll yep. just say, well, let's yep. balance them all. Yep. If you want to talk about the people that uh, are turning their backs, that claim to be Democrats and leaving it, it's less than 10%. Those that are Republicans, about 30%.